a very warm welcome to Shomu's Biology Academy and this is going to be a zoology lecture series video for all of you. Okay, now is the metagenesis in Ovelia. So this is very important. Uh, you need to know how they reproduce and how the asexual and sexual form rotates and how asexual form generates sexual form and sexual form generate asexual form. So here you will uh, get to know that part. Okay. Now metagenesis. So metagenesis is the alteration of generation between sexual and asexual form okay so they these uh, obelia or they are actually dioecious dioecious means the male and female organs are in the separate individuals right so male female separate so they are dioecious and they have two forms one is the polyform that is sessile and undergo asexual reproduction and one more is medusa so they are motile and they undergo sexual reproduction now just a minute so poly and poly uh, here now we will see what happens actually so these this is number one male and this is number two female okay so the male and female they form sperm and ovum so the male is here forming the sperm and the female is here forming ovum okay now sperm and ovum fuses and fertilization occurs so they form the zygote okay so sperm is coming from the male form and ovum is coming from the female form and these two are medusa so they are medusa one is male one is female and uh, male is releasing sperm and the female is releasing ovum and sperm fuses with ovum and they are fertilized ovum is fertilized and then ovum creates the zygote and the zygote then undergoes number of cell divisions. So they will form this. This is the modula. So this is four cell stage. And this modula will again undergo cell division. And that will form blastula. So this is blastula. The cell number has been increased here. And from blastula they will form the larvae. So larvae will now come from the blastula and that larvae is called planula. So I told you in the first or second slide that planula is the larval stage in their life. So this is the larva that planula, uh, planula that is coming from the blastula and that planula what it will do first it will swim. It will swim and then after the swimming it will just find a comfy place to settle. So this is the place. So the planula found this place for settle down and then it gets settled and when it gets settled it will form the young polyp. 
So now the larva will form young polyp. So polyp is now formed and then the polyp will generate some uh, buds and budding will be done and from that the adult adult organism will be produced and this adult organism this is the asexual form so the adult polyp is actually the asexual form and it is sessile it it is fixed to the substratum it can't move and it will it will undergo budding and from those buds again the medusa will be formed that, uh, that means you can understand here that from the polyp medusa are now getting formed so from the polyp these medusa are now getting formed and from those medusa the polyp is formed so from this diagram and explanation you can understand that sexual form yields asexual form and the asexual form yields sexual form so this is the metagenesis if you like our video please hit the like button share this video with your friends and colleagues and please don't forget to subscribe to this channel so that you get more and more of this kind of video in future thank you